Hello. Hi, I'm yes, may I have your badge number? 7452. What can we do for you? Okay, your name? I'm Officer Reynolds. Okay, I want to report child abuse. Where's the child? It's, uh, she's in Dallas. Okay, you have to bring the child with us? I, she don't live with me. We can know where she's at. Contact 911 and have someone go out there for you. Uh, can I report it here? I'm here. I can't report child abuse at a police station? No. We need the child. Okay, because I want to show the text that I get violated and bullied when I'm reporting crimes. I, I, it's, it should be criminal for police to cover up for child abuse and detain me and mistreat me for reporting crimes. So you are refusing to let me speak with anyone to report child abuse yes, at a police department? because you're saying the child isn't here. We need to see the victim. Okay, so I have to call 911. If you know where the victim is located. Okay. So that they can respond to where the victim is located. Well, how do I, uh, how, what do I do when police cover for crimes and mistreat me when I'm reporting crimes? I Okay, because I'm not safe doing I mean, they say that I'm a 911 abuse and I haven't even called 911. Because of your past behavior? Is that what you're saying? No, I'm saying that it's criminal activity on the police. Not very many police don't interrupt people from trying to report that they don't have cell phone service. Police don't ever interrupt people at support groups. Okay, well, police don't. Have... Well, are you covering for it? Because, I mean, you said because of my past behavior. No, I'm it's asking because of their past behavior. Past behavior? It's, I'm just telling you, it's criminal behavior on the police. Because people, police don't typically wait for someone to come and report cell phone issues and give them a criminal trespass to prevent it. Yeah. What were you yeah. Doing today? Well, you, I've told you about the child abuse. Maybe getting some consequences for these people that cover up for criminal activity. You if you're a police. Give a resolution to. Okay, the revolution resolution is called nine one one. If you know where the victim's located. Well, what is a resolution to the police committing crimes? That's what I want to do. They're on it for imaginary crimes I've committed, but they there's no consequences for police and criminal activity. What can we do for you today? I just told you. When police commit crimes, is our is the world that sick to where it's okay for police to commit crimes? I have no opinion. Well, you're a police officer. No. What happens when you commit a crime? You're on a YouTube channel. It doesn't matter what channel is on, if someone is committing crimes, where does the police if a police is committing crimes, where can I report it? It's not a community opinion. You're a police officer. Well, maybe someone needs to put the people in their places because police don't have a free reign to co uh, commit crimes. Well, if you're a police covering for crimes, I mean, what do I mean? I told you I want to know how to report police that are committing crimes and covering for criminal activity. This is my daughter that people have been covering up for her abuse for years. What crimes? My I reported abuse. Let me get you the information. O eight one seven one five. I flagged down an officer in 2020 and told her about child abuse. They was ignored. I went to before the police would not take reports. They're doing exactly what you would do. Yeah, not no victim. Uh, they, well, there's criminal activity because going on today. The, well, until then, it's probably. Beautiful. Let me finish. Let me finish. So you have the full story. Okay. So August first. 2019, I went to the Texas Rangers because the police was covering up for my abuse and my daughter's abuse and denied report. Well, a Garland police interrupted me there and arrested me there for criminal trespass. Okay, I tried to report abuse June 17, 2020, in, uh, at, uh, on Camp Wisdom at uh, South Central Patrol and was arrested there for cover up. They lied and said I was trying, I wouldn't leave the police department and I wasn't even at the police department. I was at the house trying to see what was going on with my daughter. So there was a lot of falsified information and tampering with evidence for police, which is the crimes that I'm trying to report. So then um, on November 4th, April 1st, 2021, I report to a police that um, there's child abuse and a lot of cover up for my daughter's abuse and my abuse. And I asked them to report it to CPS because the police refused. And they kept covering up. Now? Well, I'm giving you the evidence of the corruption with the police, okay. the crimes. Right. So April 1st, 2021, I reported to the police. He falsified information in the document and did not report it to CPS. He said that I would not leave. He had to make remove me from Salvation Army, which wasn't true. Then he came on November 4th when I was trying to report CPS when take the crimes. September 24th, 2011, my daughter had bru bru uh, bruises. I reported to CPS. She didn't see her dad for a, a while. They come and she came in contact with her dad again. And I, um, I think it's the stepmom that's doing it. He, she came into contact with them again years later. What's he do there then? 
So when like, she came in contact with them years later, my report daughter reported February 2nd, 2018, that the stepmom sat on her when she couldn't breathe and whipped her with the metal part in the belt. What city do they live in? And I'm telling you about the abuse covering what city up. Do they live in? Dallas. Okay. Now some more abuse is um, co reported. So I can call 911, but they keep cover police keep covering for crime tampering with evidence. So where's the child? She's over there with her dad and stepmom. In addition to that, five statements were made to get me on supervised visits for cover up. No one has told me what I have done. No one knows. They will not tell me what uh, criminal uh, what I have done for neglect because nothing has happened. But they cover for the stepmom. So I have no clue. Now I'm on supervised visits with my daughter. Family place FLP would not call me back. And they're keeping me uh, from supervised visits. First, I reported it to the police. Why first, they said, I know? think that some corruption is going on. First, they said, first, I was told by Detective Perez that um, it was my fault. Then I was told that it was the court's fault. Then it was the dad's fault. But for some reason, I keep falling through the cracks with the investigation. I have no clue why family FLP won't call me back. And so many parties keep me away from my daughter. A conspiracy to violate the right. Them again to see what they say? I have contacted them again. What Someone gave me a number for, um, she didn't return my call. Okay. So you can call them again? Well, I want to know why so many parties have a stop in keeping me away from my daughter and protecting the stalker. I don't know. So can I report the stalker? I think he's behind it. Okay, why can't I report the stalker? You're trying to post a YouTube. I'm reposting a YouTube because you keep covering up for crimes. And I want police that keep doing that year after year to go to jail. You haven't reported a reportable crime. A stalking. Okay. Uh, they, you keep, police keep covering for that in multiple crimes. Not a lot of people go report crimes and go to jail. We don't cover for stalking. You don't what? We don't cover for stalking. You're doing it now. I just said I want to report a stalker. I haven't been able to report him for years. Police have detained me, arrested me, and covered up for the stalking. How is someone stalking you? And lied on me multiple times. How is someone stalking you? Using the police department and government agencies. How did he know to interrupt me at AT&T? How did he know to interrupt me with getting housing in Tyler? You might consider contacting the Justice of the Peace to see if you can get a restraining order against that person. Well, has he and had his um, bullies come interrupting me there, pushing and shoving, trying know. to prevent me from getting a um, pr um, protection order? I don't know. The closest address is on the bottom, by the left thumb. So I have to find out why police and multiple parties won't take the reports and they keep covering up for this criminal activity. And who polices the police that cover up for crimes. So what you're describing, I wasn't involved in, so I don't have an opinion. Well, I'm, I am a victim and I'm trying to get so okay. help. I just went over it. I have had multiple false arrests through corruption through this. You're indicating that those resources that you've reached out to you haven't reached back out to you. So, well, the police department is tampering with evidence and reports and denying me investigation for the crimes that I report. And then try to um, say that I'm 911 abusive call to cover up for their crimes and lying slandering reports with criminal trespasses to keep me from reporting crimes. It's not an opinion. Where do, if someone is say, witnesses the police committing a crime, they get away with it? It's not an opinion, you're a police officer. If I see a police officer in the act of committing a crime, who do I report it to? Well, this is a, it's not an opinion. I'm reporting crimes to the police and you're not allowing me to report crimes. Just because it's a police officer don't mean that I can't report crimes. I'm going to report it in the past, so I have no opinion. Okay. Well, if you're a police officer and you don't know where I, a police, that's like not safe. That it is 2022. You to me? You like the, outcome. the 2022, it is not safe for police officers to not know how to report other officers committing crimes. So what can we do for you today? Well, I just wanted to know, let you guys know that it is not safe for you guys to have an inability to assist someone with police officers committing crimes. Reach out to Justice Peace. Are you the last, the one that wouldn't let me do the report last time? No, I haven't spoken with you. You've never spoken with me? You said report last time, I'm asking you a question. I haven't spoken with you about report the last time. I was trying to report child abuse and stalking, and a report, a report was not denied then, too. And today, when you brought up those topics, I asked you where's the child. Yes, I know where the child is. So, as a result of the child not being here, recommended that you call 911 with an address and send the police there. 
Well, here's the problem. The police have been covering for the child abuse for years. That's why I had to develop the YouTube channel that you guys don't like. But I'm ready for people to start going to jail that cover for child abuse. Today, it's sick. Today, if you want to report it, that the child is going to jail, send the police to the address that you're aware of. They'll take it from there. Well, they've been covering up for it for years, arresting me and detaining me for cover up. So you I just told you I need to combat the corruption of the police department, okay. covering up for crimes. What do I do? I have no you have no opinion on how I report criminal activity with the police department. Well, that's a red flag that it's really happening. Okay. You don't cover for. No, if you can't tell me how to report, if it's all in my mind, you'd give me the information, but it's cover up, so you don't want me to know where to go to report it because it's a red flag that it's really happening. It's just your YouTube channel. Well, you today. You, how do you know about my YouTube channel? I never told you about a YouTube channel. We have resources. Right, you have resources, but you keep covering for child abuse and you keep covering for the corruption of the court and you, you forget about that, but you're worried about my YouTube channel? We do for you today. I, I don't know, but I mean, this has been going on a long time. It's sick. It's sick. So this world, they know about the YouTube channel. Well, how long are they going to keep getting away with this? This is sick. What can we do for you today? It's sick. So the, like a robot, what can we do for you today? It's sick. What else can they get paid to do and get, get, get ignored? I, I am trying to report the abuse of my daughter for years and have been have, have getting arrested and detained. I think it is sick. And I'm not sure the resolution for you. You may not like that answer. I have been trying to report this abuser, this stalker for years. I think that it's sick that you cover for him. 76% of stalking ends in violence. What can we do for you today? I think it's sick. How are you being stalked? You can answer my question. Uh, he's abusing government resources for stalking and have police covering for crimes that he commits. Jason Gardner of Vivid Images, I've been reporting him for a long time, and his name keeps getting left out of the report, and police keep denying the reports. Okay. So they're stalking you, but they're abusing governmental resources? The two aren't the same. He's stalking and abusing government resources. Like, you won't do the report? report you, yeah, the see, government. like, you won't do the report? Report that to the governmental bureau. And uh, multiple police officers cover for crimes all over and won't do the report. Okay. Like when I was threatened, my arrest was threatened for reporting identity theft? Can I ask your question? Sure. Okay. What benefits are they abusing? Well, he's able to have the police enlist the police officers in stalking and then have them cover for it. Like my bank wouldn't give me money at my own account. And then they wouldn't take a report to show that I was railroaded, like when my car would keep getting disabled when I try to make a purchase, and police wouldn't take the report of that. But evidence shows that I had to go to the attorney general to get it reactivated. I did not disactivate the card. Somebody stopped my whole card altogether. And it was not easy for me to get to the attorney general in Longview, Texas, to keep that, get that card going again. But police would not take the report of someone controlling my card. So if someone can control my card, food stamps, and so, uh, child support, and police cover for it, Well, why, what reason is the police not um, doing an investigation and allowing me to report crimes? Why won't you guys do an investigation? I don't, think, I don't know. Well, it's sick. It is. It's sick. What is going to do for you today? I, I don't know. I don't know how long you guys are going to continue to get away with it. What is going to do for you today? You haven't done anything. So I can't report any crimes. You don't like year after year. Unfortunately, that's the procedure that's set up. Okay, for the child abuse. I want to be able to prevent police coming out, bullying me, reporting crimes, arresting me, and violating me, committing crimes themselves. What were you arrested for? They, at um, Garland, they lied and um, they uh, interrupted me reporting child abuse. And Dallas Central Patrol, South Central Patrol, lied in the report saying that I wouldn't leave the police department. Did you go to court? What do you mean? No, they wouldn't let me go to court for cover up. No, I don't get uh, the crum uh, the corruption is so big they don't even allow me to go to court. We can't prevent you from going to court if that's your right through the uh, Dallas County District Attorney's Office. They prosecute. We don't prosecute. We can't prevent you from going to court. Well, I did not go to court. I could not present my case in court, and it's happened multiple times. That's why this is sick. People don't need to abuse power to that degree to where they're so corrupt they can't even you can't even go to court. So I'm reporting child abuse. This has been going on years. 
So I, you, a parent comes in furious because they can't protect their daughter, and the police have been enforcing it for years, and CPS. The most thing that he's worried about is my YouTube channel. He's ignored the other corruption, the child abuse that's been covered for, the arrest that... Uh, at Texas Rangers, all of that and the problems that I had with my bank and my card, they've been covering for that for years because I think they're behind it. That's why they cover for it. So let's see what happens when I call and have the cover up because they've been covering for the child abuse. It's a felony. It's a felony. That's what Perez said. What can I do for you today? If you're, you're not willing to do anything. It's been going on years. Have a good day. You have to listen to what we're offering and advice and suggestions for you.